Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve question number third of exercise 7.1. And the question says AD and BC are equal perpendiculars to a line segment AB. We have to show that line CD bisects AB. Now here it is given that this BC and this AD are two equal perpendiculars means the length of this side and the length of this side is equal plus these are perpendicular means this line is making an angle of 90 degree with this line and similarly this line again making an angle of 90 degree with this line and you have to prove that this line which is CD this line bisects this AB means this line divides this line in equal to parts. Bisects means dividing something equal into equal two parts. So you have to prove that the length of AO is equal to the length of OB. Now you have to prove to prove that uh, the length of AO is equal to the length of BO. You have to prove this and these two things are given to you and to prove that the length of this side and the length of this side is equal what you need to do is you need to prove that this triangle and this triangle is congruent these two triangles are congruent if you are able to prove that then obviously by CPCT that is corresponding part of congruent triangle by that property you can prove that this side will be equal to this side now how to prove that this triangle is congruent to this triangle we know that there are many properties to prove that now first of all it is given that the side AD and the side BC are equal this, this is the first thing so in triangle in this triangle BOC in triangle BOC and triangle this AOD in triangle AOD in these two triangles we have to prove that this is congruent to this and in this triangle it is given that AD in this triangle is equal to BC in that triangle which is BOC this is given to you again these are also given that these are perpendiculars means these two lines must be making a 90 degree angle with this line so obviously this angle and this angle must also be equal because both are of 90 degrees so we can say that angle A will be equal to angle B because these are equals to 90 degrees both are of 90 degrees similarly one thing can also be concluded that this angle must be equal to this angle because if two lines intersect each other then the pair of opposite vertically opposite angles are equal so this angle must be equal to this angle similarly this line and this line intersect at point O so this angle and this angle must be vertically opposite angle so these two angles must also be equal so we can say that angle BOC which is this one BOC this one angle must be equal to this which is DOA so this angle must be equal to angle DOA this is vertically opposite angles so in these two triangles we have proved that the set of three things are equal means this side is equal to this side this angle is equal to this angle and this angle is equal to this angle so by angle angle side by angle angle side because two angles in one side in this triangle and two angles in one side in this triangles are equal so by angle angle side we can conclude that triangle BOC is congruent to triangle AOD which are these two triangles this is by 
एंगल एंगल साइड प्रॉपर्टी सो बाय एंगल एंगल साइड प्रॉपर्टी वी कैन कंक्लूड दैट दीस टू ट्रायंगल आर कॉन्ग्रेंट एंड इफ दीस टू ट्रायंगल्स आर कॉन्ग्रेंट मींस ऑल सिक्स पार्ट्स ऑफ दिस ट्रायंगल मस्ट बी इक्वल टू ऑल सिक्स पार्ट्स ऑफ दिस ट्रायंगल एंड व्हाट आर दोस सिक्स पार्ट्स थ्री साइड्स मींस थ्री साइड्स ऑफ दिस ट्रायंगल मस्ट बी इक्वल टू थ्री साइड्स ऑफ दिस ट्रायंगल एंड थ्री एंगल्स मींस थ्री एंगल्स ऑफ दिस ट्रायंगल मस्ट आल्सो बी इक्वल टू थ्री एंगल्स ऑफ दिस ट्रायंगल सो ऑब्वियसली दिस साइड मस्ट बी इक्वल टू दिस साइड सो बाय सीपीसीटी corresponding part of congruent triangle this is corresponding part of congruent triangle we can conclude that ao must be equals to bo and this is what we need to prove in this particular question so this is how we can solve this question i hope you have understood how to solve this question if you like this video please subscribe to our channel and if you have any problem in maths you can directly contact to us the phone number the email address and the whatsapp number is given below in the description thank you